If you haven't heard yet, ChatGPT is an AI chatbot that can write codes and answer any type of question. It doesn't have internet connection, so all answers it gives are produced by AI itself. Some people consider that it might eventually take over from Google. We've made a lot of science videos for this channel, so let's ask some scientific questions and see how ChatGPT responds. Sometimes we'll deliberately make grammatical mistakes and write typos just as people do all the time. We want to see if the AI will be able to understand us. Let's start with a straightforward question. What's the farthest galaxy? A new candidate has been found, but ChatGPT has got it correct. Next, let's ask, as in one of our latest videos, why are there no green stars? Most of the information is correct, but then it says the colour stars emit do not include green. Actually, this is wrong. Some stars emit all colours, including green, but we see them as red, orange, yellow, white or blue. But the answer is still promising. Now let's ask a difficult one. Who invented the seismoscope? Wow, we thought it was going to say I don't know, but it does know. It's even written about the working mechanism. Impressive. Now let's ask about the Fermi problem. We think it's really likely to fail with this one. But surprise, surprise, it knows what Fermi's method is. But its estimate is too high. Let's ask again. It's getting closer. We think it's done a good job. The actual answer is 83. Will it continue to learn? Let's ask again. it hasn't made any more progress. It seems that it may have to come across this question quite a few times before it learns to be more accurate. Let's move on. Let's ask another difficult question. During the Second World War, the Japanese used balloon bombs which they called Fugo, meaning code Fu. Does ChatGPT know? Yes, it does. Very impressive. We've asked a lot of questions and ChatGPT has come back with an answer to them all. So, we've been very surprised. We didn't think it would be this successful. We tested it, 
and have to say it passed. It seems likely it'll become very advanced in the near future and may even be a game changer. <laughs>